In this video I'm going to teach you how you can make a follow age command with stream elements. My name is Tree and I make extremely support videos. Stream smarter, not harder. But before I begin, I stream every Tuesday and Friday, 8pm to 3 p.m. time on twitch.tv slash Tree. If you have any questions about streaming, just hop in and ask. So step one is go to streamelements.com and log in with your Twitch. Then go to the left side and go to commands. It's under the bot tab. If you do not see it, it's probably folded and you just need to unfold it. And just click on commands. Then here in the fall commands, we scroll all the way down until we see something called a follow age. You can also search by doing Ctrl F on your keyboard and typing follow age. Then we need to make sure that this is on. Right now for me it's on. If we click on it, so in here we can change a few things. So for example, if you want follow age to be called something else than follow age, this is where you can change it. You can also set the user level. So if you don't want everybody to be able to use the follow age command, you can set it on subscriber or moderator only. Command cost, I would leave that at zero. This means that it doesn't cost any loyalty points to use. User cooldown and global cooldown. User cooldown is the cooldown for the person that just used the command and for the global one, it's for everybody in chat. Now we have command aliases. So right now there's an alias called how long. So if you do exclamation mark how long, you also get the follow age. You can add more in here and just type them in here and press enter after. So for example, um, follow time enter. Now also follow time is a command that will lead you to the follow age. Command keywords are words that if somebody types them somewhere in their message in your Twitch chat, this command will also trigger. This is a bit spammy, I would, I would not recommend doing this. Now you can choose to enable the command when you're only online, only offline, or both when you're online and offline. I'll just keep this as it is and click on save. To make sure that this works, we need to go to our Twitch chat. So go to your Twitch profile and click on chat. Right here we need to do slash mod stream elements and press on enter. For me, stream elements is already mod, so it will say that. For you, if you haven't done this yet, it has been added to your moderator list. Now, what we want to do is test it. So what we do is we type follow age, boom, and it will say tree has not been following tree because I cannot follow myself, so I've not been following. But obviously, if somebody else types it, this will actually give the amount of time that you're following. That is how you can make a follow age command. It is super easy. And I have a lot more tutorials about commands for stream elements. So if you want to learn more commands, just hop into this playlist with me. I'll see you there. 